It is important to remember why we are all here, because a 14-month-old child has died. Her death was tragic and has deeply affected everyone involved. There is no doubt in my mind that our systems could have done better for this child. And with our acceptance of these recommendations and our commitment to act upon them, I am confident that in the future our children will benefit from the improvements that we are making today. This is not a complex case at all. There was a child with two broken legs and it was reported to the police and child and family services. I did not ask the panel to lay blame, but I can also tell you this. Every single day in this province, including today, we have some very uh, hard-working staff that go out in the field on our behalf, and they, they look after some very complex, challenging, difficult situations, and they make their decisions based on the information that they have at that given point in time, and that I would caution people from second, you know, guessing what the staff made collectively or individually in regards to the information that they had at the time. The suspicion, making the suspicion and the diagnosis of a, a child abuse case is extremely complex. It is difficult. It takes not only into consideration the type of injury, but it takes into consideration the, time, the timeliness to presentation to a caregiver. It takes into consideration the explanation of the injury. It takes into consideration the actual caregiver, the ability of caregiver to deliver care. So there's a number of factors that's come into play and then influences a health professional in making a referral to child and family services. The law says that we have to have reasonable suspicion to make a referral. And we, we do that on a daily basis. And I, and I, and I want to point something out right here, right now. Okay, the person responsible for the death of this child is a murderer. Somebody murdered this child. The person responsible who owes owes, that the, the, the holds full responsibility is the person we will investigate and find. We will bring that person. That, I don't care how long it's going to take. I'm going to assure you that right now, and I know you know that. The last sentence does it. You know, they, they said there's systems problems and information problems, and the bottom line is they're, they're making steps to change things. Um, they said there was inadequate critical thinking, you know, they can't really step forward and say, yes, it's our fault that baby was murdered. Um, you know, did anyone predict that this was going to happen? No. Um, yeah, she said that there was problems and things are going to be done different.